At long last, the Samsung Galaxy S4 has been revealed to the world. The Korean firm's latest flagship device was the star of a special New York launch event last night, where TechRadar managed to get its first glimpse of 2013's most anticipated Android handset. There's a 5-inch Full HD display on offer packing 441 PPI. Although the screen is bigger, the S4 still manages to pull off a sleeker form than its predecessor, measuring just 7.9mm thick and tipping the scales at just 130 grams. Speculation over an 8-core processor has proved true. Samsung's Exynos 5 Octa chip will power its latest handset, clocked at 1.6GHz and with 2 gigs of RAM. That said, some regions will be receiving a Snapdragon-equipped quad-core variant instead. The design is a bit uninspired, retaining the polycarbonate shell of mobile's past and striking a balance between the Galaxy S2, S3 and Note 2 devices. A metallic band around the edge of the device does give it a more premium feel, but apart from that, there's nothing really to phone home about. Still, looking past the superficial reveals even more innovation from Samsung. There's a big emphasis on contactless gestures. Also included is the Note 2 inspired air view, plus a whole host of other features like S Health, which we'll cover properly in our in depth review. The Galaxy S4 comes running the latest version of Android 4.2 Jelly Bean, as well as a refreshed version of Samsung's TouchWiz overlay. The device will ship in 16, 32, and 64 gig variants and sports a trusty micro SD slot for expansion. There's also a 2600 mAh battery under the hood, although it remains to be seen whether this will be sufficient for the S4's 8 core prowess. Of course, the Galaxy S4 is 4G enabled and comes with basic connectivity options like Bluetooth 4.0, Wi Fi, and NFC. The camera has been up to 13 megapixels and is capable of recording 1080p video at 30 frames per second. There's also a 2 megapixel lens around the front. The Galaxy S4 is set to launch on April 26th, costing around £480 SIM free by our estimations. Head over to techradar.com for all the news on the Samsung Galaxy S4 launch and check back soon for our official verdict.